to brand new audience. That's how it was for me that all the time. No, because the, the subject came into my head, right? We're going to yeah. talk about Mortal Kombat, and I was going to maybe introduce the subject first, and then I took a pause and back. No, but I have to tell them what we're doing. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so welcome to <laughs> Brand New Multiverse. Your host, C.Y. Chung and Kyle Charles. And today we're talking about Mortal Kombat. Uh, Mortal Kombat 1 from 1995. Yeah. Mortal Kombat Annihilation. Yeah. Mortal Kombat Legacy. Mortal Kombat Scorpion's Revenge. Even Legacy is season 1 and 2? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I watched it as one big thing. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, That's why I did. Um, oh, and Rebirth, if you want to count that as the technical prequel but not really it's the, 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 what spun off into Legacy oh yeah yeah the little clips yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was yeah. like what the hell is it um, so, so Mortal Kombat 1 let's just start there wait, let me give a bit back okay. story people who don't know Mortal Kombat in 1992 in the whole arcade fighting game hype an American company decided hey we're going to make our own one but it's not going to be 2D it's going to be 3D with 3D spies so, uh, film, film, not, not 3D, 3D, not 3D, but yeah, um, films, uh, film, films doing this stuff. Yeah. Yeah. not cartoony, not a cartoon, yeah, um, or anime, the web is. And then Mortal Kombat was born, which is a game that gave the CBA e- the age rating for games because yeah. of this. So, um, so technically, they were like, they saw Street Fighter and King of Fighters, and they were like, we yeah, were let's fun. make it like film the characters doing the stuff, yeah, uh, the actual actors, or something, whatever, right. And then if we make it more brutal, we can get a bit of uh, notoriety. Yeah. And then just kind of went... Went where it went. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Went the way it went. Um, now, at this point, you can crack but people's arms, then uncrack them, and still continue to fight, yeah. and they continue to fight. And, like, it's and you like, punch them, and like, litres of blood come out. Yeah. yeah. Also, originally, it was meant to be a John claude Van Damme game, but he turned it down as, like, we made half his game. Yeah, Let's yeah. go. Johnny Cage is... Uh, I mean, Van Damme is now Johnny Cage. Yeah. Let's just continue. Yeah. <laughs> Who can speak perfect English now, I'm just saying. And then um, we sprung many sequels on Mortal Kombat 2. It came out, I want to believe, the following year? In 94. Yeah. No, 93 or 94. Yeah. Then Mortal Kombat 5 and 4. And in my personal opinion, after 4, went downhill. Mortal Kombat 3, you said Mortal Kombat 5. It was 2 to 5, wait a minute. Four. <laughs> I went, no, no, I think you said, you said Mortal Kombat 2 and then Mortal Kombat 5. And I'm thinking, hold on a second. I said 4, then, 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 yeah, yeah. then it becomes... Dark Alliance, yeah. and yeah, just goes downhill. And then by Armageddon, they've realised they've messed up their own storyline. Yeah, 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 not that they was... When we get into this, there's yeah. not even much of a story. There's a story, but no actual tournament rules. But we'll get to yeah. that. Yeah. And then, so, the company that owned the game, Midway, went out of business in, 90, in 2008. And in 2009, Warner Brothers bought the whole rights of Mortal Kombat... With a re- and they made a reboot game, which they realised in that game, our old storyline makes no complete sense anymore. Let's reboot. Yeah. And then since then, it's been great again. I'm <laughs> firstly honest. You know, I actually buy the game for the story now. No. Yeah. What? Buy a buy game for a story? Yeah, no, what? I'm, yeah. Because nowadays, because online, you don't really, like, back when we started playing fight games, you go around your friend's house, you will be playing it. Yeah. But no one really does that anymore. So, oh, yeah. and playing online, you get all the glitches and so it's just... <coughs> I'm okay. sorry about that. So, so yeah, so yeah. this game, the, 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 the film. Yeah, sorry. So, so what I was saying about the rules of so watching all these films, uh, various versions. Yeah. I don't actually okay. What the actual tournament rules are, I don't get. As no. in, as in, I know what the tournament is about. Yeah. Uh, Never Realm or Our World, whatever. Try uh, have won nine tournaments and they're trying to invade Earth Realm. Even and, uh, that when you when. Even when you think about that, it makes no sense. But I'll, well, you gotta no, but on. That, what it is to set up the tournament is acceptable, yeah? Because yeah? it's on the tenth one, and the Ephraim loses, then then they can uh, outworld or yeah, can invade. All right, but what the actual rules of the tournament itself? Because it just seems like people fight people, and some people have more matches than other people. Yeah, and some people can just challenge other people and decide to fight yeah. them whenever they want. It makes... And we're like, why don't you just have a multi-man match then? In that case, why don't you just jump two guys at once? It makes yeah. no. Uh, I think in one clip in the movie, Goro, when he decides to have this fight, yeah. All you see is this like massive uh, clip show of him just bodies Broke just people. flopping down. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then it's like, well, so he must have beaten not ten people there, but Luke Kang's only fought three people. Yeah, right? unless he had other fights that we we're not seeing. Yeah, yeah, which yeah. Still makes no sense. Yeah, and I don't think Sonya Blade only fought Kano. Yeah, that's what she fought. Yeah, one fight. Yeah, but yet she was able to be challenged 
by Shao Kahn. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we'll uh, okay. <laughs> so, so uh, as I understand it, Johnny Cage challenged Goro, and then Shao Kahn, Shao Kahn said, "Well, if you're challenging Goro, I'll turn. Then I also want to change the rules, but uh, and I can challenge anyone at any time, at any point." And uh, Johnny Cage like, "Well, I don't want Sonya Blade to potentially maybe die by yeah. Goro's hand." So I bet, yeah. And yeah, then, it's... and then Shao uh, Shang Tsung does the sneakiest thing I've ever seen uh, in this movie. Full of sneaky things, by the way. He goes, Sonya. he grabs on your blade, and then he basically says, uh, teleports away and says, "Son, your blade, I challenge you to Mortal combat. Do you accept or do you yield?" Making it sound like they're the only two choices. Yeah. She said no, but she only because she is saying no. Like yeah, yeah. but she didn't thought of the the logic of she can just deny his. Acceptance, yeah. but also deny yielding. Yeah, like they're two separate questions that you put together. So one will be a consequence if you don't do the other. Um, but I think if she just simply said no, and I'm thinking, but did you? You think you out thought him without thinking? Yeah. He seems like I'm stuck in the corner. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do I, do? Oh, but, but I don't think she thought hard enough about what exactly I said. Yeah. And if she thought about it, maybe she would have been tricked. But she just instinctively reacted <laughs> and uh, confounded him. Like, he, in the whole nine songs are done, <laughs> this has never came up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's like, really? <laughs> uh, yeah, um, there's lots of things in this film. Yeah. I still like this one, don't worry, you're wrong. Uh, it's, it's, quite, it's quite enjoyable and entertaining. Yeah, uh, it's, it's the best way I can put it. It's still, it, it, unlike most films of the 90s, it still kind of holds up because there's. Not too much special effects and stuff, so it's yeah. not like oh, that. The, the fights are decent. Actually. Yeah, yeah. Beats, they're not. I want to say the, the Hong Kong style great fights, no, no. but they're actually pretty decent. And um, it's silly and campy when it needs to be, and it doesn't take itself too seriously. Yeah. and that's why it's enjoyable. Um, things we could lead on to say about the sequel. Yeah, we'll but that, but we'll, we'll just stay that here. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and like I said, Goro. Yeah. Looks like a pretty good special effect. Yeah, he's actually still, you know, he's looks solid. Yeah. Um, uh, they didn't need too many special effects like you were saying before. Um, the, the Your Soul is Mine and stuff like that. They yeah. had all the they had the right happy people <laughs> to play certain roles yeah. that didn't take it too camp. Like uh, the guy playing Shang Tsung, um, Kari, Kari Yuki uh, Tagawa. Yeah. Yeah, he, Your Soul is Mine and Fatality. Yeah. Um, no, 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 not Fatality. Flawless victory. Flawless victory. Even, though, even though the actual fight, the guy got hit a couple of times, so it never <laughs> was a flawless yeah. victory, but whatever. <laughs> It's... I met him, by the way. Really? Yeah, yeah. So I was filming. I say I was filming, yeah. but I was an extra in the the forty seven Ronin. Yeah. And he he's the lead bad one, well, the lead bad guy there. But he he's the, yeah. the emperor, whatever it is. And uh, yeah, he ha- he handed out his um business stand cards oh, wow. um to his website to yeah. the extras that were lining up. Last thing I saw him, and he's in his emperor clothing. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it's Shang's army. That's what the card <laughs> says. That's Shang's army, and I was like, "Oh, this is great." He's. I like that he's still to this day. Like, I want to say, twenty five years on, he's still. Yeah, he's still. Like, and that was the point before Mortal Kombat Legacy. So he wasn't recast at that. Like, yeah. He wasn't cast back in to the role at that point. Yeah. So that's so pretty. He, but he was still, you know, stuck with him for so long. Yeah. Even now, he's in like Mortal Kombat yeah. Eleven, the game. Yeah. That's him. You know? Oh, yeah, that's awesome. But but um yeah the move the the. What were you um. This, what are you going to say about what you liked or disliked? Or which parts are you going to go to? Um, there's only a few. Like, um, um, it's just like looking from the outside. You're like, you know, when they all get invited to like the tournament. Yeah. Uh, there's lots of, like, first actually, no, this is the one I watched this first time. When I watched it now, I realized that makes no sense. Yeah. Why did Luke, how, like, firstly, you know, only apparently how they've gone the rules. Yeah. You can only travel to, each realms during more combat. So yeah. how did Liu Kang's brother get to I want to say outer realm, outer world whatever it is, to fight Shang Tsung from the So uh, oh, I, I know this is not actually what they say, but you could just pretend that was the previous tournament. Well I don't know how long the previous tournament was, but the guy did look like a kid. However, however he didn't age when, when he came out of Shang Tsung's body later on. Um, but we will just pretend that's the earlier generation, right? right? It, no, I don't know. I don't know. Is it a tournament like one, once a generation? So is that like every hundred years? Uh, it depends on you. No, no, because you could just say, okay, no, it wouldn't even work still. But let's just say, um, Liu Kang's brother is the generation. His older brother, so it's the generation above him. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
But even that could be just like um, it's an awkward because you just assume generation is like from the father to the son. Yeah. To the, unless you're gonna say his older brother was like nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 Uh, unless that he's probably. Uh, but he's a young. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and then it's supposed to be young. It looks like his younger brother. Yeah, but but then he died recently because he gets. That's why at the beginning of the film he gets a telegraph saying your brother's died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> like, why did they well, say this? Wait, wait, but, but but let's just not miss this, right? Well, throughout the film, Shang Tsung doesn't seem to care about the rules anyway. No, he just makes up the rules. Yeah, so, so he's probably just decided to make up the rules anyway. He went to the temple, like, I want to kill this guy for the day. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I want to bitch slap him about, yeah? Why? Because I can. And then say, because I know he's going to somehow see this in his dreams. I want to drown him in his face. You! <laughs> yeah, but, okay. But besides that, I'm like, okay, but, but, I don't know why it took me this long to remember that. I was like, why did I never question this before? <laughs> yeah. And then there's other things which I'm like, like when um, when they go to Hong Kong to get the boat to go to our world. Yeah. Why is no one questioning there's a big dragon boat? Clearly, these are just clearly these are things in Hong Kong. Have you been to Hong Kong? No. Yeah, well, exactly. Like, exactly. I'm these pretty things sure. All the time. <laughs> pretty sure. No. <laughs> Even in the '90s, no one was still going around on like. Medieval wooden boat. <laughs> so these things are like okay, all right, all right. But the, the thing is, it's probably maybe you could just do like um, the people there are just tunnel vision and blind to it because it's like it, it's things that happen so often there that oh shitty they're like yeah. Whatever. It's just a, you know, it's, no, but, just, yeah. it's just more questions. Right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they need to answer. Yeah, uh, get along with my day. And there was another weird like that as well. Yeah, boat. and then when they're on a boat. Why does this is what creepy? Why does Liu Kang and Johnny Cage follow Sonya to the lower level of the boat? I get that's where they meet the ninjas and all that stuff. Yeah, but like, isn't that a bit creepy? You barely know this woman. We're gonna follow her down to. Her. Yeah, yeah. Uh, all I can say about that is, is when you got a a, um, a lady looking like she's going through a dangerous situation, you yeah, you'd be like, okay, I guess let's make sure she's pretty safe. But... Yeah. Yeah, uh, gentlemanly, of gentlemanly, course. Yeah. Uh, however, nowadays, yeah, 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 so, well, not nowadays, but when you look at it like that, yeah, you're like, like, you guys could be the most shady as exactly people. Exactly, all people, there's two of you, you know. <laughs> and then, <laughs> um, also, I love little things that you put, I picked up when I watched this film. Yeah. You know, Ray's always gone about, oh, people are the great and the innocent people should die, whatever. Yeah, yeah. But then he lets loads of innocent humans, or earth rummers, die in this tournament. Can you say, yeah, you know what? You don't stay on Earth. Yeah, yeah. I bring these three guys. So I know they're going to help me win. You yeah. guys are kind of butter, really. I, you know, it's um, kind of especially bad is when that the, the one black guy that Johnny Cage referenced for no reason. Yeah, for no reason. I them for him to get killed by Goro. Yeah. I was like, oh, if they like made more that like him and Johnny Cage were actually friends before this, yeah, they'd yeah. be more like, oh, that's quite sad that he died. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, 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 exactly. It's like he just met you. Oh yeah, I'm a good fan. Oh, yeah. Oh great. Yeah. We're best friends. That's all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's not Halloween. Well, that's not, all right. Cool. Um, but as we say, we don't even know the item rules of the tournament. No, really. people just fight other people for. I mean, you like to say logically, right? He probably wouldn't want his team to fight other of his own team. Yeah. Members. But then we, you don't even know. We know this. Shang Tsung's side and Ra- Raiden's side. Yeah. But then how do you get so many people in the tournament yeah. to begin with? That's. How many of them are actually fighting? And, how and then many? what happens to everyone else that's. Yeah. And why do we only see the, the cool main characters left over afterwards? Are makes... we saying that everyone died? Everyone else died? Exactly. It makes no. It's like, wow, you, you keep going to how Earth Realms is the best, especially uh, in the next one. Yeah. But then you just let, like, Goro and Lowe kill about 10 humans <laughs> then. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, wow, that's a bit. Mm. Uh, the, yeah, and. Uh, yeah. <laughs> these These are. What, what, what did you think, by the way? Because you know how Scorpion and Sub-Zero are meant to be rivals, but yeah. here they're just like uh, minions of Shang Tsung. Now, logically speaking, this is what I came up with. To, yeah. to I mean, first of all, they never established... In the, in the movie, they haven't established that point, so you don't even know... Yeah, you don't, yeah. They're wearing the same ninja gear, so you just assume... They're both from the same clan or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. same group. Just, and if you want to put it in your own mind to justify all this stuff, their eyes are... Like blurred out by the content lens, but yeah. they, they kind of got so you say, Oh, Shang Tsung might control them, maybe, yeah, and that's why they're teaming up together, yeah, because oh, I, I reckon, right. like, 
script wise, they didn't know. That's why they didn't yeah, yeah. the point or anything like that. And yeah. I mean, uh, like you said, they're both ninjas. No one will really question it. You know what I mean? But yeah. then in the next one, they sort of reference it, which makes yeah. it. We'll get down. Yeah. Afterwards, but what I'm saying is, like with this tournament, people got magical powers and weapons and all this stuff, right? Like, like uh, Luke Kang was fighting someone with a bow staff. Like, as in both of them had bow staffs, yeah. right? And then Scorpion's got uh, his, his grapple web is. Yeah, or web. Yeah, web they make as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the lizard spy, uh, Weber. Yeah. As, and some where he's got, like, ice abilities. And, like, okay, but is everyone allowed to use such abilities? I guess they can. Yeah. Why not? Yeah, well, at least make us know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> like, 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 why do people fight with this and people, people fight with that? Unless they're going to say it's all out fight, whatever's in the arena, you can use. Yeah, but like at least make it establish that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what else? What I thought was weird, like Kano was literally just, and his whole thing with he's pointless, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah was, he was like, he was just to just to crack a joke. Give me a break, lad. Yeah, and then oh no, also a funny thing about that. This goes referring. This goes to the game. You know, before this is the reason why in the game they wrong, he's Australian. Yeah, because originally he was going to be a Japanese guy. And then, part Japanese yeah part like Japanese American whatever and then yeah they was like oh make more training for the game for the film and then no 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 what they did what they did was uh, okay. so they hired a guy uh, and who was quote unquote Australian yeah he's not actually he's, not, he's English at the time yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so he, he he was English and he from what I read yeah he he was like oh there's not many Australian actors out of Stuntman or whatever out here right yeah so let me Tweak my accent, and then maybe I'll get more variety of roles. <laughs> He's and then, and then, yeah, he got cast in this, and that's why they, they adjusted him to uh, the character Kano to be Australian. I'm like, yeah. oh, okay, yeah, okay. okay. And not that it makes it doesn't make a huge difference, but no. now he's more instead of being partially Japanese, he's just all white. Yeah, okay. fair yeah. enough. Fair enough. He's just white. He they and then again, look at backstories. We like, yeah. He was he went to Japan because he thought, okay. I can rule the underworld, which basically ended up doing. Yeah. But yeah, and then brought it to America, and everyone thought he was Japanese in the game continuity. Yeah. So they see him, oh crap, you're actually white. Like, yeah. yeah. Maybe he's he had, yeah. a, he, had a, he had a really good time. Yeah, good time. <laughs> From a distance, he looked like he might have been. Oh, he could be. Yeah. <laughs> can you speak Japanese? No, no, no. No, no mate. No, can't mate. I speak no, English. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, no, be, uh, yeah. Any other. Um, um, just going to touch on a little point. Yes. Um, that Scorpion and Johnny Cage match. Again, what you're saying. All right. You've got people fighting rings. Yeah. But then they're just fighting an open forest. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Establish this. All right. Whatever. I, I think though, partially because of all this nonsensicalness is what makes it what Yeah. It what makes it like, 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 this is crazy. I mean, there's nothing here to establish anything here. No. But at the same time, it's like, well, that just means it all bets are off, isn't it? Yeah. And the thing is, well, you don't question it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But other things, the first two like, question, like, why does that mean? This you don't until after, like, <laughs> he's just walking in the forest, and then and then you see Scorpion, he comes steps out of the tree, like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. the fight, like, <laughs> exactly, exactly. And then they fight and all that, and then <laughs> they teleport to the Mushroom Kingdom from the Super Mario films, <laughs> and they're just fighting now. I'm like, okay, this is so weird. Have they established that he can do this? I'm, I know the game, but I know he can teleport to hell, whatever. Yeah. Cool. That's fine. But well, I know if it made no sense to me. When he cut Scorpion, why well, is his blood lava? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I was like, no, because then they, they do the fatality reveal where he, take, he takes off his mask. And, yeah. Uh, even though, logically speaking, yes. But it's just it's just unjust for that next yeah. segment. I'm like, okay, I can't, okay, I can't make sense, but why? Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty sure, like, Demon spawns or whatever don't bleed lava. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but, okay, cool. Great game. But yeah, it was a good fight. Um, Sub Zero. Yeah, yeah. Um, I did like not the ingenuity of it, but it's just like, okay, so Luke kind of got around the fight. Yeah, that was cool. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's a nice execution of the idea of throw the water at him, it'll, turn, it'll hit his um, ice bubble, yeah. and, turn, and, and then it'll turn into Spike and like, Oh, that's neat. But then you just you just cut out an entire fight. Yeah, <laughs> literally, like oh, okay. And how how Katana has some like precognition. Well, she's one that's telling him, oh, use whatever. No, no, no. Well, okay. Technically speaking, 
yes and no, but she told him to use something, and I guess he could have worked out yeah to uh, to, to use it. Ice against the guy who creates uh, it was against a guy who creates ice. Uh, yeah, whatever. Because like I'm not going. I was going to moan because in the games ice is at home, obviously, but I'm not going to yeah. bring that in because that's the game. No, oh, but but for some reason this ice barrier cannot pass wa- where water is. Oh, I don't know about. I mean that. Maybe something we assume that she already knows. Yeah, whatever. 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 It makes sense <laughs> at the time, I guess. Um, we spoke about the Kano literally just crippling people. Yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure you only kill about two of them because only two when they hit the ground stop moving. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> stop like, like, oh, okay. Yeah. He just crippled them. Um, reptile again. I'm pretty sure again. They didn't know this source material, so they made up reptile. I'll tell you what's kind of funny. So I read that they, and you can see it afterwards, right? Yeah. But that entire reptile vs. Luke Camp fight was not in the first car. Yeah. They re- they they, they reshot the shoot and put it in. Yeah. But what's funny is they referenced the thing that the reptile that was guarding um, Katana. Yeah. So it's like, all right, why did you write that in if you didn't have something to do with reptile later on? Yeah. But I think they just then just they. Test all this web and they thought, okay, well, we can put an extra fight in because we just happened to have done this at the beginning. Yeah. And that was a neat fight as well. Yeah, like, it, was, it was cool. I was like, oh, that's fine. And, and the bicycle good. kick at the end of it was a bit funny because it, it kicked him. It, the, the, the bicycle kick looks silly in motion when you do a long, uh, wide shot when yeah. you see him go. But when they was close up and it's like hitting him in front. Yeah, that was uh, good. Yeah. Uh, that and then good. when he did the final kick and school, uh, reptiles started doing those flips. Yeah. yeah. Was, like, <laughs> without, the, uh, without like the armless back flips. Yeah, like what? <laughs> that is no sense. <laughs> that literally, I had to rewind that. Laugh like that. That is so silly. Yeah. Um. Then we get on to that's bit we already talked about. Yeah. Sonya getting kidnapped and then challenged to more combat, but she says no. Yeah. So just make her a bit novel. <laughs> I, I, I think at this point, I at that point, Shang Tsung's mind just like exploded. He was yeah. like, oh, wait, 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 what? Wait, what? <laughs> Do you realise? Right? What my word was, I told you to shoot you. Do you realise it or not? But clearly she did. Yeah, <laughs> like, he's like, he's like, just thinking, scratching his brain going, all right, um, how can I reword it without, without, without and trick her, without That's outright crazy. saying anything, you know. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's like, like you say, it's the first time you've ever realised that someone yeah. said no. He's like, <laughs> and he's like, never expected this. What was going on? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but they, they make him look so chicken. Yeah. Like they, they challenges Sonya. She said no. Then Luke, they challenges uh, Johnny Cage. No. Yeah. All right. Okay. Fine. Then I guess I have to fight Luke. Uh, Luke uh, that fight was pretty good. I, I tell you what's kind of funny when you, I'm watching it again. Yeah. Not to say um, they look like Robert Shu and uh, Karen Tokwa. Yeah. Look like they're in shape. Yeah. I just find they they bust out with those ninjas yeah. or spirits or whatever. That, that Shang Tsung pulls out, I'm like, uh, is, is it because they're trying to give Liu Kang more people to fight uh, or to, carry, uh, to help hide the fact that Shang Tsung uh, probably doesn't, I don't know, as a man, he's yeah, a man, yeah, yeah. stamina or, or he does, the sequence is too intricate or something yeah. like that. But he's just like, oh, we're going to have a little bit of uh, distractions here. Yeah. So then, we, then, then they can carry the, the stomach can carry the. Yeah, I didn't think that. That makes sense now. Because like, I thought about it, oh, like you like you were saying before, they were trying to show him overcoming the odds or whatever yeah. by fighting three ghost people. Yeah. But now you find out that yeah, probably what it is, they just like he can't go for that long, let's throw this in there. Yeah. Makes it more spectacular, but also keeping him looking okay. Well yeah, but then and and, and, and as we've could we've speaking about for this entire time, Shaq's all about right, the changing this thing. Yeah, exactly. that, 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 the character is perfectly... Yeah, it makes sense. Well, okay, we'll do that. Yeah. It buys into his character, so cool. And then the Mortal Kombat song plays. Oh, like, this game. This is amazing. So, so, that song, that, the, the Mortal Kombat, this thing makes like, all the fights ten times epic. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, they're all right, they're all right, they're all right. They're all right. But this song gets so like, you hey, hyped hey, for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, the, yeah. the best fight ever in a film, but then really it's not, but it's so hard to get to it. Yeah, so, yeah. Oh. Then he beats him yeah. by uppercutting him off a balcony onto a spike floor. Reference to the game. Also, there's more game references in it, whatever. And then 
Raiden's like, I knew you can do it. Yeah. They go back somehow. They, they, they put the shoulder, the hands are skipping around. Yeah. Them, like, you know, they're, they're best friends that just won a uh, basketball game. Or something. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and they go back to the temple and they're like, yeah, I knew you can do it. <laughs> Christopher Lambert, before we go on, Christopher Lambert is yeah. probably the best interpretation of Raiden, of Raiden because it makes no I don't get what he is. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> but you accept it. Like, yeah. Whatever he's doing, you're like, oh, I'm going with it. I'm going yeah. with it. Which is one of the bad things that sequel we get into. Yeah. So yeah, they go back. Temple, everyone's happy. Um, then Skeletor appears, aka Shang Tsung. He doesn't like Skeletor. Skeletor, 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 Skeletor. 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 Like, That's a really you scene from Moth Universe. <laughs> and then he goes, what did he say? Uh, I'm not sure exactly. He says so. Oh, I can't remember. It, wasn't, it can't be that important. I can't remember. Yeah. And then they all go to the fight pose. Yeah, and they go, I don't think so. Do, do, do. Uh, that made me think of Power Rangers. Yeah. Yeah. Something like that. Even the fight when they had with the no name lackeys in yeah. their cave. Yeah. The fight sequence had all kind of shot. It reminded me of Power Rangers. Uh-huh. And then, yeah, um, before we move on to the next yeah. film, um, what did you think overall of Modern Combat? Yeah, yeah. I'd. Um... Entertaining is that is the is the only way I can put it because it's not great but it's not bad but it's silly yeah but it's also fine <laughs> yeah. it's like well you know I can't I can't I can't say too many bad things he knows what it is mm. uh, and there's not too many bad things you can say about it specifically like oh this was terrible it's yeah like, all for the effect of, of the campiness uh, all wrapped into one so it's like yeah okay, it's very it's watchable yeah, it's watchable it's, 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 it's rewatchable as well. yeah 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 it's and one quick question. What was your favourite scene in the whole film? Well, do you know what? Um, what was yours? What was yours? Oh, what mine, because it's so... Oh, yeah, now I've got mine, but... but, but it's so funny in this out of place. When Johnny Case and split dick punch. <laughs> yes! And, I was, and then goes, well, dude, those are $500 glasses, asshole. Like, oh, yes. <laughs> I, was, I was actually... So I was going to say... I was going to say one of the fights, but then that's when I was like... Hold on a minute. <laughs> it's better than I was, it was like, oh yeah, 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 I know the, the, the scene. And it's, yeah, the splits up. It's just, it's just, it's silly, it's but silly. it happily suits so exactly what it is. And the other little honorable mention I think I thought was hilarious is when Rain is talking about the Earth dying and laughing. <laughs> so they're like, wait, what? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You think genocide's fine? Okay, cool, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, the, the, the movie does have standout moments. Yeah, right? it does. And the, the poor things that. The bad things are not generally that bad. Yeah, you can't accept them yeah. within the context of the film. Uh, but yeah, the split punch and uh, yeah, yeah, because <laughs> Goro sells it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we were like movements. Best. Even though I reckon someone who was a half dragon man would walk, wouldn't move like that. <laughs> so now we'll let's get on to um, Annihilation. Annihilation. This was more this was, Annihilation. This was poor. This was very poor. Um, Firstly, because they saved the the World Combat theme song until the very end. Yeah. The very end fight. And it's just like, no, I mean, we're trying to listen to that entire thing for the entire movie. Yeah. And then it's like, no, this this uh, invasion will be decided by Mortal Kombat. And they changed bits of notes. I was like, oh, this isn't the same. Yeah. Um, it's going to breeze through this film. It's uh, so much problem. Yeah, well um, <laughs> so it, end, it starts with the last one ended. Yeah. With a different looking Shao Kahn. Yeah, yeah. Well, to be fair, you didn't see his mask. Though. No, you do. No, you do. Oh, you do. Yeah. The mask. In the mask, in the first one, yeah. it actually looks like his face is a skull. Oh, okay, okay. So then when you see this one, oh, no, I think it's underneath. Yeah, no, no, no. No. Um, and then moments in, you notice, wow, 90% of the cast is different. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Kind of place in the show. Clothes just change inexplicably. Yeah. Because you're a new actress, but randomly. And hair is short. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, Johnny Cage is a different guy. Yeah, but I didn't notice that at the time I was he watching was I'm, it. No, 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 they look, they look similar the same. Not till, like, recently watching this time. Like, yeah, yeah. They're two different people. Yeah, yeah. But no, no, no. When, you, when, you, uh, when you're watching at the time, like, they got the guy, they gave him the t- similar clothes uh, yeah. and, and the hairstyle and stuff, and he looked like similar facially to the other guy, yeah. just a bit more chubbier. No, not chubbier, but he just had, the, like, yeah. Yeah. bigger. Uh, slightly in the face, in the cheeks, but it's like, oh no, no, he looks similar enough that you could, you, you could buy it, yeah. yeah. Even though he's only about two minutes, yeah. Um, Raiden is James Remar, yeah. I, I love James Remar, don't get me wrong, but as Raiden, god, uh, and he was just completely not the same as um, Christopher Lambert, yeah. Like, he, he, Christopher Lambert sort of like rules the scene, what he's in, you know what I mean? Like, 
Because oh, okay, so Christopher Lambert, Fred Lambert plays it like he, uh, Raiden is a cranky old crazy wizard. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, James Remar has to play more seriously. More seriously, more like no, no, like emotion. I don't know. There's serious consequences to this tournament, but yeah. guys, don't worry, you can make it through. Something. Yeah, and just it's so cheesy. Yeah, and um, so yeah, that ha- that then Shao Kahn does a swan, if I'm correct. <laughs> people jump all the new bad guys jump out yeah. which are pointless we'll get to that yeah. and then he does a swanton into the crowd of people he starts fighting Raiden right yeah right. Right, right and also so they do leaps right which are kind of it's like you put the graphic of him going up and then you just pull them even further yeah. they're in the same exact cut out shape and then let them do the template yeah. right? like right because they're, they're, they're too static and too in the same formation for too long, yeah. Was... I, I think mean, just because it made them look like oh, because they're gods, they could jump higher. Yeah. It just looks a bit silly because it's like the background. Yeah, it's it's poor. like the like, right. screen is poor. Even ninety nine seven, this looks bad. Yeah, and then <laughs> there's a little tussle, or whatever. And then Shang Song grabs Sonya. No, no, Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn, sorry, I'm gonna keep forgetting that. Shao Kahn grabs Sonya. Saying he's going to kill her or something like that. Yeah. Raiden goes, no, I'm going to kill your people. Put some no, 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 Johnny Cage. Got oh, yeah, Johnny Cage says, no, does he shadow kick? Yeah. Which he doesn't do in the first one, yeah, yeah. which is stupid. And then he gets battered away and he just grabs him. And then that's on the whole, like, if you kill my people, I'll kill your people. Yeah. He's like, whatever, cool. And he breaks his neck and then someone's like, Johnny, no! Yeah. I'm like, oh, you guys in love now? you barely spoken a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But okay, cool, whatever. And then... Shao Kahn's like, oh yeah, we're gonna inflict more combat in seven days. You know, it took six days for the world to be made. I'm um, gonna end it in six. Yeah. So the good guys run off. Yeah. And then they're like, oh, we need to go to plot point A, point point B. Yeah, Why yeah, are you yeah. going to plot point C? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 okay. yeah exactly. You're it's literally, true. you're literally like, okay, we'll get into these individual bits later. On, yeah. But, yeah. <sighs> And then, then uh, and then we all rejoin later on yeah. to fight in our Megazord. It's yeah. not Megazord. Yeah. Like, <laughs> they all fight, and then we fight the appropriate amount of bad guys that relate to us for some, some yeah, sort of yeah, for spiritual reason. And uh, Liu Kang then fights uh, Shao Kahn, and then yeah, he finishes yeah. Shao Kahn as well. But the funny thing is here, so you once more combat has been uh, initiated, called, yeah, 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 then you, you, and accepted. That's when that's when you know you got the tournament is starting. Yeah, but Shao Kahn he, he initiated more combat, right? But if the guys just said, said if the guys just said no, no, Shao Kahn, see you next uh, generation. Yeah, it'd have been done. Yeah, like, oh, all right, Again, I guess I can't wait. Really plot hole. I mean, I suppose I could wait for this invasion. Uh, yeah. No, but then they changed the rules. Yeah, and then uh, they... to say, oh no, an invasion's fine, but you can't merge the realms. All right, okay. But I, could, I guess if I still not accept more combat invitation to the tournament and the tournament doesn't begin, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. And then and then I like and it's, I don't well, like to be fair though, he's Shao Kahn and he can do what he, no as in the same with Shang Tsung, he can do whatever he yeah, wants. wants. As a plot tip mate. Yeah. Oh. One yeah. thing about this film as well I thought was hilarious. Yeah. And he tried to throw in everything from War Combat yeah. two and three into one game. Like Alamant Alamanta well, Animality. Yeah, like okay. Oh, you must seek out Mike Wolf to learn how to do that. And then he's in it for one, for two minutes. Two minutes. And then disappears. And that's it, you're like, um, there's Rain, uh, so Purple Ninja. Yeah, who gets, gets done. Um, Who's backstory in the games is quite important to the whole thing. Oh, no, apparently not. <laughs> in this film, no. He's not. Uh, Shiva is, is done as well. Yeah, we put best in line out for Mama, I thought you was dead, but... No, no, that's no, Sindel. That's Sindel. Sindel. Shiva's the one with the four. Shiva, yeah, Goro's cousin. I don't know. Um, but yeah, yeah uh, Cyrax and um, Se- the red type. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I think the the problem is they've had they put they were like and Sub Zero and Scorpion as well. Yeah, yeah. So they just had too many people, and just like okay, we're gonna throw everyone in here, even though we don't need to. Yeah, and then we're just gonna have them in the scene, but then they disappear for no reason. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And uh, I had I had the Sub Zero come, uh, I had the Scorpion come back after he got burnt. Today, yeah, like, literally like, in the same day. When you think about it, it's yeah, the same yeah, day. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and then. There's already a new Sub Zero, and you're like, oh, I thought I thought you died. I don't know his brother. Okay. Um, but how do you really know that your brother's dead? Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Uh, and they just fight and they disappear. You're like, all right, maybe they'll come back. Maybe they won't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I never did. And then what was the other funny thing I thought? Like, oh, with Jax. Jax. Oh, How they reintroduce Jax makes no sense. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Completely different character again, or whatever. And then, so he's maybe, remember when you last saw him? He was yeah. in Hong Kong with, with Sonya, yeah? And then he's like, oh, Sonya, you must go and fight Jax in, I want to say, Area 51. This is safe there. Yeah. Uh, which is, when you think about time wise, that makes no sense. Two different time ways, whatever. Yeah. But he's getting metal arms. Yeah. So he's getting melt over his head. Mm. Sabinating in his house. Yeah. Well, I say he's just, every line he's saying, though, it's so crap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's just like, oh man. And they just got a black guy, just give him the most typically black lines ever. Yeah. I mean, it's different. <laughs> Samuel Jackson said these lines are different. Right? Yeah. But this guy's not putting them off with any. No, um, because, like, well, he's, he's just he's saying that. Because yeah. you know he's an American gladiator. Oh, really? Yeah. That yeah. Is. That's I was going to say, because whatever he's saying, it, he could put it off with some style, but he, this guy just... Yeah, he, he's not delivering with any... Like, I reckon if you talk to him normally, he probably... He probably could, yeah, yeah. I yeah, mean, yeah. I think Wesley Snipes could say these lines probably yeah. and give it some sort of, like, a charismatic delivery yeah. or, or distinctive delivery, but this guy's just delivering lines because he looks like the part of the guy. Yeah, yeah. it's like... But if you know that guy's lim- acting skills are limited, yeah. don't make him talk that much. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. I mean, like, Mar- so when we get to Michael J. White, when Michael J. White... I can see him as Jax and yeah. this guy he just doesn't have the authority mm, yeah. or the believability to be kind of that role. Yeah, it's just like, oh, God. And yeah. then the whole little thing behind him, uh, he's he lacks confidence. That's why he's got his male arms, but later on, he'll know how strong he really is. Yeah. Oh, God. So I have to say, okay, well, some good things here. The costumes are actually pretty good, um, like to how the games were. Yeah. yeah. And okay, finally, they need to expand it to where it is, right? Um, they're not like muscle suits. Like yeah, stuff. yeah. They're basically just cloth on cloth. No, it's fine. Sindel's, yeah. Sindel's costume looked good. She was one of the, the, the latex yeah, yeah. where it is. Um, Montara looked pretty good for CGI yeah. body uh, and center. Uh, Shao Kahn's armor. That looked pretty good. Yeah. Um, what's his name? Jax's. Okay, it's like cheap plastic, whatever. But it's, it looked kind of the part. Yeah. But uh, I, and um, the thing that kind of took me out of that though. Uh, like, and then the upgraded ninja fingers. ones. Yeah. Yeah. And the, 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 the upgraded ninja. Yeah, they look good. Really, I really, I thought they were really good yeah. for. Again, yeah. something made in nine ninety seven. They look pretty. It still doesn't. They don't look outdated or anything. No, they, they look like they do the job and they look like ninjas and they look similar to the look of because on the first one. You know the the, the coloured sections. Yeah. They're just coloured sections, but here they're, they're like diamond, yeah. hexagonal kind of. Rid- oh, I can't do what it is. We only talking about. Yeah, they, they they got shapes. Yeah. But um, and then it was like they wasted all these people because yeah, they didn't really. for no reason. Uh, like I'm watching the fights as well, which what doesn't make this as good as the first one is the fights just are lacking yeah. in any sort of oomph. Mm. And I'm like, well, you got ninjas in suits. Yeah, you stun people for yeah, exactly. Suit, right? Yeah, why why can't you get these? Why can't you get the stun people in the suits and, and then you're gonna have to all these? Because they do the. I don't want to say they do the. Jump the up. choppy American yeah, yeah. style, where everything's edited to around. Yeah. But it's just like, well, look, man, you got stunt people. I mean, if you get stunt people in the suits, then you can have the extended yeah, fights. Maybe you can have your B unit or whatever it is. Yeah. Shoot those. You can shoot. You can deal with the main stuff. Yeah. Like, the, the, if this movie's about the fights, tense and it's yeah. called cool Mortal Kombat. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. The layer happens, but, but the uh, like say the some solid CG and some crappy CG. Yeah, we'll the animality. Yeah, that made me. Li- I'm not gonna lie. I literally felt sick watching that. Like stop motion. Was it even stop motion? I don't I know. Think it was like a mission to stop motion yeah, yeah. CG. Whatever it was. It was yeah, terrible. and then and then when the um, I think eight Jade as well. Like yeah, uh, like another character which they've done wrong because yeah. in the game she's not. It's not her who's a traitor. It's Tanya. Yeah. Yeah, Jade's actually. She's actually K- Katana's best friend. And bodyguard. Yeah. So in this one, it made no sense. No, even even out the even out of the, it's just like oh she's dead. But then what? I assumed that she must have killed Nightwolf because he was there in the scene, and then he wasn't there. Yeah, the scene. exactly. And Melina as well. They threw Melina in there for yeah, no yeah, reason. Yeah, that, that looks like, to me blatantly looked like a inside breach. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Because like Sonia and Jax just beat up the the sidewalk. Yeah. And they escape, and then later on she gets ambushed. Um, Randomly, while they're in the middle of the desert or wherever it is area, and no one else is in the scene until Jax comes out a bit later on. It's just like, well, I guess you just threw in more fight for no reason yeah. because she's all muddy afterwards. Yeah. And then next time you see her, she's all clean. Yeah. I'm like, okay. And especially another thing, again, like, you can't take mine out of this. Like, Katana, you wish. Like, she does nothing like Katana. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Um, yeah, like we said, same for these pro all characters. Realistically yeah. speaking, for the close up shows, so they just sort of got the lady that played the garlic to wear yeah. a mask. If they're going to have someone looking similar, if they yeah. want to. Um, but you never see the lady's face anyway, so no, this is like. You, but if you're going to have it be all oh, the person that it's supposed to look like, yeah. at least have the person it's supposed to look like then, in there. And that's just throwing more questions into this plot, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah. So that's, yeah. Uh, uh, it, it, look, as a, as a film that's meant to be a martial arts fights film, or something like an action film, it's got, I don't want to say too many, too much story, Yeah. but stuff gets in the way of the actual action, and when the action comes along, yeah. like, then it's, it's, it's not, I don't want to say it's not good enough, but it's just tame compared to what yeah. it should be, and this film takes a bit, itself a bit more seriously than the first one, Yeah. and that's why it's kind of not as enjoyable. Because like you're saying, they try to throw too much it tries to throw too much story in, but the problem is the story's poor. Yeah, and, yeah. and, and we do, you don't watch a film like this for the story yeah, anyways. Yeah. You just need something basic mm-hmm. to get you from there to there to there to have more fights. Yeah, but, uh, oh, Shao Kahn's invading our from People, um, beware. We've got to go and stop this invasion. Boom, done. Yeah, just not, go in there. And it, like, you know, the worlds start trying to merge. You're separated, and then you can go in. You just, you, people just get teleported, separated in yeah. the, the individual parts where they have to then fire over to the other part and then they will meet up afterwards. Boom. Yeah, not, so we don't. Not send you here to get plot device B while you yeah. get plot, and then throw in random... Yeah. Especially since it's not even swirls. an official... It's not meant to be an official tournament anyway. You know? no. It's like, oh, I'm going to invade because... Yeah, I especially at this to, point. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's like, it doesn't even need to be um, any serious story. Mm. like... I'm going to go do this and that, and you've got six days. No, you want to invade right now? Yeah. Get everyone back in here, and all my guys are going to fight your guys, yeah. except that or we're going to be sneaky. You have to be just aware. Or we're at least, sure to use. if you're going to invade invasion, a show actual invasion is happening rather yeah. than you're just sitting in your war room. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For six days, until the, the, the fifth yeah. or the day, and you're like, oh, you know what? Maybe it's time to enact my actual invasion that I've been planning since five days ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. It's not. It's not. It's not good. I don't even know how well uh, whether the lady playing Sindel could uh, speak English because I don't know if it sounds like they dub her lines or whatever, but she's acting. Sure. La- <laughs> she's acting louder than she should. Yeah. Most body motion uh, wise, and then her lo- whatever she's saying is like she's emphasizing too much with her yeah. mouth to get the syllables. It's like I don't know if she is English. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just saying. Yeah. No. It's one, one, it just looks like. What's coming out of her mouth doesn't sound like it's coming out of her yeah. mouth because she it sounds like done afterwards. Yeah, yeah. she's enunciating too much with her mouth to get the the points. It's like too much. Uh, yeah. um, then they throw in a random swerve that Raiden is browser Shao, Shao Kahn. Yeah, yeah. Shao Kahn's off guard, and I was like, even in the, I was like, you just ruined the game with this because yeah. even in the game they're doing on that because and then and then and their their dad. It's one of the spirit elementals, whatever, and he's decided to back Shao Kahn as his uh, course to to take the yeah uh, right, like, yeah okay. And then the older gods are like, oh uh, uh, uh. yeah, oh we just watch, we just yeah. watch, we don't intervene, like but until what? until until we decide that yeah. we are going to intervene at the end. <laughs> yeah, uh, and because he's the, the well, thing that wound me up, I didn't realize that now because his dad's called Shinnok in this, yeah. Yes, <laughs> and Shinnok's not his dad. Yeah, yeah. He's so then not rubbing anyway. Yeah, yeah, so he's like, okay, whatever. You made Raiden into. Sh- then they sort of made Raiden, Raiden into sh- Fuji, and not his brother. Yeah, made. Um, yeah, he gives away his god power. Sorry about that. But then, but then he gets them back in the end. Yeah. Like, uh, then turn his hair grow back. He's got his god power. <laughs> who, 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 who knows what they were actually trying to do with this film? Is, is the logic here? There's uh, many, many things wrong with it. Yeah. Um, they just. Just tried to stuff too much where they didn't need to. Yeah. Uh, and they could have just kept it basic. Yeah. Just like the first one. Uh, but then I don't think they had someone like the uh, Carrie Tagawa to have the charisma and, and campiness and happiness, but also the actual acting ability to carry the thing as a villain. Not to cast the guy who played Shao Kahn, but he was. Was it intimidating? No, well, he looked kind of the he part. He looked it, but when you hear him, not in bad, not yeah. when you hear him speak, like, oh, God. Yeah, he, no, the way he's playing it, he's really having it. And it's just like, you don't know, you don't need to be like this. Yeah. And like, whenever he spoke, I could felt like, you can, he just felt like someone you can't be scared because he's getting orders from someone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shao Kahn is like some just nutcase who yeah. 
would kill anyone just looking at him. But he's like, oh, God, yeah, daddy, tells, yeah, yeah. Yeah, daddy tells me off, I gotta, you know. Yes. Yeah. And then the whole, my brother died. No, he didn't. What? Didn't he wouldn't he know that Shao Kong? I don't know. And then another we're gonna just end it. We'll move to the next one. No, no, yeah. no, I'll have one more, but then I'll, I'll go one more as well. Before I just end the crap. Yeah. Um What's the whole thing, the dragon tattoo things? Just so that they can say, Oh, he has a tattoo, my brother has that tattoo, oh right, you have a tattoo, right? And then it's yes, but Shao Kahn has a tattoo. <gasps> we're related. Oh yeah. no, my brother. Yeah. But um, also, the, the, the other thing I was going to say, because it relates to Raiden as well, yeah. where he's got to fight all them ninjas. And I'm like, right. So this is clearly a bunch of stuntmen fighting, because not saying James Rumar is not K-pop doing this stuff, but yeah. it just, it's inserted just to put more fights in. Yeah. And it's like, right, but he's not fighting anyone other than the ninja. Couldn't you get, get someone for him to... As a character with those abilities, surely you could just have him actually fight someone. Anyone. And if you're going to have the stuntmen doing jump spin kicks as Raiden, might as well just have him... Give, actually be able to do your fights. Yeah. Um, and the stuntmen, they're not doing that much. Uh, the ninjas as well, like one versus three, but you would have thought they could have choreographed a good fight. Yeah. Uh, what? Yeah. Like you said, like, yeah. Is, you, None it, of the fights were particularly no, good. If they threw in all these characters, they could have got released ready to fight one of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Instead yeah. of no name ninja yeah. number four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> number four, five, and six. Yeah, it's just stupid. So, yeah. yeah. I mean, no, this, it just... All around, just not good. Uh, yeah. Um, but re- re- so we'll go in the chronological order. Yeah. Rebirth. Now that seven minute short film, Michael J. White, um, Jerry Ryan, Jerry, Jerry Ryan, yeah, yeah. and uh, Ian Anthony Dale. Yeah. Great. Yeah, great, great, great little short story about them interrogating. Um, the yeah. yeah. And then you know, obviously you don't find it till the end. He's school. Yeah. yeah. But very well done. Very. Um, I like it. That is, I don't want to say basic, but it's more less fancy, mm. more gritty based. Yeah. Uh, even though it takes liberties with the source material, it's like you get you let it slide because that's the the way they go. They 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 take it, but yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. And also, it's not gonna have a huge budget, so nobody have to do no. all this craziness. Uh, the fact that they could the, the stuff they come up Baraka's uh, makeup and stuff like that with his um, yeah claws in his arms, like oh, and all the fights they did there as well. You're like for for I don't know how much budget they had. But they got a decent amount of stuff they could put they put in there. Yeah, and then how they reverted the fantasy characters to more uh, logical stuff that yeah. would happen in the world, like what they did with Reptile. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, fair, fair, fair enough. Uh, this might not be how you're going to keep. I'd like to see a version of this. Yeah, because even in like yeah. re, not rebirth legacy. Yeah, they kind of get away from the whole mm. what well, is up in that. Isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, any quote comments about more about rebirth? Before we move on to Legacy. Uh, no, I remember seeing it. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah. Um, like, we, you got to say it. Uh, so, more come about Legacy, the web series. Yep. Now, they did move away, like, from Rebirth to, to from the more gritty, realistic stuff. Yeah. But they still kept uh, ideas. Yeah. And tweaked them enough that you wasn't too far-fetched. No, yeah. Uh, like, when, when, like, they gave the backstory. So, this entire thing I see as a... Sort of like a prequel yeah. to the tournament. The game. Yeah, it's the lead up to the tournament. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you just look at it like that. It's just like, yeah. this is how everyone gets here. Yeah. Even though some of them don't get there. And, and some well, of them it, there this could be a potentially yeah, how, yeah. How, how, yeah. how a version of the story can be told. Like, yeah. Kind of, yeah, okay, yeah, it makes sense. Um, where they where Kano loses his eye because Jack's punched him in the face so hard, yeah. Like, like yeah. But then they they they, they sold her on that the the metal. Yeah, it's like okay, yeah, that yeah, yeah, makes sense. That's no, why he that's why he hits Jacks. That's why he yeah. hits on your blade. You know, because they were after him. Yeah, uh, Jacks uh, the bomb that was, that was set off too near Jacks. Then this um well whatever happened to him, that's why he gets cyber hitting yeah. Oh, Okay, I found it a bit hilarious though, and they go oh yeah. yeah. You know, oh, the grenade is, yeah, he got his back a bit, but then more concerned about his arms. I'm like, hold on, should they be more concerned about his back? Because <laughs> if he can't walk, <laughs> you know, so I'm like, okay, I get what they're trying to point out, but yeah. like, that's uh, a bit weird way to phrase it. Right. Yeah, uh, I mean, but why they made, why Kano, so why the cyborgs were created it makes sense, because yeah. Kano was uh, part of that. Yeah. You know, trying to make enhanced beams or something. Yeah, so, to, to make Link way more. Um, controlling, so you yeah. can control them more because of you know free will. 
yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. It's just more like, okay, the logic that they're there is yeah. accepted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I find it hilarious that they promoted Striker. Because, you know, like, in the game, Striker yeah. is a normal police cop. Yeah. Police cop. A <laughs> normal policeman. Yeah. But this now, he's like a lead detective or whatever, the FBI, or whatever. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Field operate, whatever. Yeah, yeah. then he just suddenly changes that person. Person in the next one. But to be fair, that guy, who, Eric J. Cavus, who plays Strike in season two, yeah. is actually a stunt man. Yeah, makes sense. Um, I thought so. So he can fight. Yeah. So that's what you need him for when you. And he actually looked it more like in the Strike gear. Yeah. yeah. Um, what, is, what is strange is I think some of these guys are cast because they're actors. Yeah. And some of these guys are cast because they, 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 they have, they're the stuntmen that have to help lead the fight. Yeah. Because they're the ones carrying it. Because it's. Do you want to say, oh, actors, you want you need always someone could in control of the fight. Mm. So if the stuntman is knows the sequence, he can help lead through it. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's why I think they recast some people. They are uh, stuntmen. Yeah, I thought my budget thing, but you might you're more yeah, like. Right. Well, they're probably cheap as well. These yeah, stuntmen. But you know, they, they, as they say in all these in these movies, you always need at least a, if you're doing a fight sequence. Unless you train the guys for months, yeah, you, you need the stunt guy in there to help lead the um, the fight. Um, I did like how base how they, they, they take on Johnny Cage. I was a yeah. washed up actor. You got caged. Yeah, oh, God. Well, like that. I was like, oh, yeah, it's better than other ways they portrayed him, where yeah. he's always been like on top and everything. Yeah. So it makes sense that someone like him will go to a tournament. Yeah. I could credit. fight for real. Yeah, like yeah. it makes yeah. sense. It makes sense. Some well, people, some people, some people. Some actors out there are martial artists. Yeah. I don't think can fight for real. Yeah. It just no didn't... name, no names. <laughs> but there are others who are like, you know what, yeah. They could do that. Yeah. 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 And I like how they said that he was on Power Rangers, like, okay. And they went, oh, and Power Rangers been on the other side. No. <laughs> Power Rangers is still going strong. That's probably most one consistent thing in the like, last no, but, I mean, they're, they're but yeah, it's making it more relevant. Um, then the origin of Katana Sendel. Yeah. Yeah, Shao I like, I like the animated bit. I like that That's quite um, good. Yeah, the, the lady who plays Katana, I think she's a stunt Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. The only thing. Because she's got a build, like, yeah. like oh, that's, that's great. I mean, she's not super chunky on the Katana, yeah. but it's just like, this lady looks like, you know, she's she a can, yeah. yeah. But they change her in season two, don't they? Both. No, no, no. Katana stays the same yeah. as a Melina. Melina can yeah, change. Yeah, Melina can change. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just thought it was hilarious. They set up the whole Shao Kahn thing. He doesn't appear in the season. <laughs> no, he does. He does. He's the one who steps up um, the king. What, well, in season two? Season one. Oh, it's right. No, he, oh, yeah, you don't see him again in season yeah, two. Yeah. Um, the whole Sindel putting her soul into Katana thing. I was like, what? Well, uh, yeah, I mean, I, look, I don't know if that happens in the game no, or not, but, but whatever, you know. <laughs> like, that's a weird thing to do to your child, though. Like, like logically, like, yeah, I, you know, but it's not unacceptable that some of the fancy elements they put there, like, up yeah, no, no, no. Uh, I, I, ex- probably they're not going to use Queen Sindel in this, so I guess, fair enough. Yeah, fair enough, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if they don't use it, it makes sense they could do this, but, yeah. like, because in the games, you find out really. So they have to unlock that level, you find out. Yeah. That Sindel was in on the betrayal the whole time. Cause, oh, really? Yeah, because they try and, you know, your whole before they try and play yeah. on that, she wasn't. Yeah. You find out, yeah, she really, really was having an affair with Shao Kahn, they've done all that stuff. Oh, okay. oh good, that's nuts. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, and I like the Melina thing. How long? Yeah. yeah, but I didn't like how the Baraka people look, the Takatans look. They look like something from like Lord of the Rings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I would like them to stop with the origin from Rebirth, but if you need cannon fodder, for example, you just have a whole bunch of barracas because that's, yeah, yeah, that's what they are. Yeah, that's what they are. Yeah, but it just, take, just takes the threat level down yeah. quite a bit. It's like, oh, I, yeah. Because yeah. even the the baraka that kills the fake Jared wasn't even baraka, you know, it, it was just a no name to Cartoon. It wasn't yeah, baraka. Yeah, yeah. So, um, um, yeah. Well, uh, I did. I did like. Obviously, they they cast Shao, Shang, They put Shang Sun back in season two as, as yeah. uh, Carrie Tagawa. Yeah. Um, and I also like that the cast was as Kung Lao. Yeah, I like that. Sense. Awesome. And also, what made a lot of sense to me was how Liu Kang was on the um, Shang Sun side, the, the yeah. side. I was like, because of his journey. Yeah. 
there, and I don't know if they were saying because in my mind, like, when I was watching, I was like, are they trying to say that Mortal Kombat one and two? I mean, Mortal Kombat one kind of happened because they're like ten years ago, whatever. And I'm thinking, oh hey, so maybe a generation ago he fought for Elf Realm, but now he's just something's yeah. happened in between that, like his his um, girlfriend. Yeah. And now he's just like f off. Yeah. I'm just gonna I'm 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 gonna fight on the side that I'm yeah. gonna fight on. Um, but I don't think they did that. But it would have been logical though to move like he was a champion. Yeah. On Elf Realm. And then he defected because yeah. of everything that was going on with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he's a he's a high gun now, basically. Yeah, yeah, but, but, but I don't think that's what they actually did do. But it would have been it would just worked for me logically, logic wise. Yes, yeah, one has got to prove yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Like um, because they he, like comes out talks to him as though he was like meant to be the chosen one, the champion, or whatever. Yeah, but I think if this carried on, if they did the additional seasons, he might have just swapped back. Yeah, he would have by the end, right? To the other side. Yeah. yeah, I reckon by the end he would have. Uh, another thing, did, I'm not sure if you knew. Uh, you know who Katie Lotz is, right? No, Katie Lotz from uh, Arrow. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So she was. I read somewhere. Yeah. I can't remember. Who, uh, I think Casper Van Dien, who was the new Johnny Cage in season two. Yeah. He referenced something about her, hmm. and then people thought, oh, maybe she's going to be the new Sonya Blade in yeah. season three. But then season they never got season yeah. three. Uh, and I would have thought, okay, I guess it makes sense that you swap Jerry Ryan out, so you're probably busy. Or yeah. But then you've got, you've got to do fights. You might as well get a girl who can also yeah. do all the fights. Who's a lot younger. Won't be bad, not yet. She's, really not... she's a lot younger as well. Yeah, yeah, I don't know how much younger she is, but, 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 but the point is she can do her. Yeah, she do what she's got to do rather yeah. than... Yeah. Just stand there in the back. Yeah. Because yeah. like, don't get me wrong, I, like Jerry, I did like Jerry Ryan as um, Sonya, but now I thought about it like, later on, I was like, yeah, this is gonna, I'm just going to fit into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I did like also, but yeah, there's lots of bits to like uh, on the budget that they were doing. Yeah, yeah. And, and did you watch there's a full movie like yeah, that? Yeah, like, uh, like, like, yeah. It's like okay, so everyone's everyone's getting like the little prequels. Yeah, to lead them to the tournament. That's yeah. the, but you you were saying sorry. Um, I liked there's two really big things yeah. I actually liked about um the little that one episode about the origin of the. Cybernetic Link Way. I like that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, like you brought up earlier. Um, yeah, yeah. Came on. I like that. It was pretty good. Um, but I really liked how they did the Sub Zero Scorpion relationship. Yeah, I yeah. thought that was really good. Yeah. And they sort the game sort of inherited that slightly. Yeah. Um, yeah, I liked how they were friends as kids. Yeah. Older, some even though they messed that up a bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, because they're like, okay, first of all, how does this take place in the past, in the future? I mean, not in the past. This is like modern day? What, what, well, apparently, from what I've gathered from the game as well, they live in villages that are representative of the, of the that time. 18th century time. But yet they still have weird bits of technology. So all we can say, all I'm going to say is this, right? Yeah. That feud, whatever it is, yeah. right, happened back in, way back in the day, right? Yeah. <laughs> but because he's dead and I'm dead, yeah. he, he, to him, it's more recent the more recent past, which you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. You can say, oh, he died during then, and then a hundred years later, got resurrected, but to him, yeah, but it just happened that, yesterday. But think of that, because, I don't know, because it, yeah, yeah, your, your race might make sense game-wise. No, but then, 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 then yeah. how can Sub-Zero be, yeah, 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 no, yeah. No, 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 no. it doesn't it's, make sense. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't. I'm just going to say, Sub-Zero can, uh, slow down his aging. Yeah, yeah, well, we'll do that. Like, think Captain America stuff, they put yeah. stuff on the chick, nice chick, then we jig and then, Revive himself later on. I don't know. But I, don't know. I don't know. the only thing that like, threw me off of that bit like the younger brother dies. Yeah. They swap it around. Yeah, I'm like, but then see, you're kind of muttering, you're kind of ruining yourself in the future because young Sub Zero is a big character going forth from the two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because even like the whole ninja stuff relate to the cybernetic ninjas connect to him. Yeah. And then you killed both Sub Zeros in this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> But, but but no doubt one of them's gonna like they, if they got to a season three I don't and I, I see I believe one of them or both of them could be resurrected somehow. But then um, one the older one in the games yeah refer so I keep referring back to it. the older one becomes new sub, new sub yeah yeah so then it's like yeah, I, 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 yeah. well uh, you know what I mean I'd like to have seen the ideas for season three yeah same because um, uh, the end Blue Kang being a, a, a hero was interesting hmm. how whatever they were gonna do with Sub Zero to bring him back. Would have been interesting yeah. as well. Um, how if yeah, Sonya Blade and um, 
Jack's Jack's team back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get related to all this. Kano, if you could have done stuff. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, our actor has passed away, so. R.I.P. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, it's all, they, they, they set up all interesting stuff. Yeah. yeah. You could do the follow up. Like, how, how are you going to get certain characters over to. But it randomly teleport people over to, to the island where yeah. it is. So it kind of makes sense. Have yeah. You, people then just come over on a boat. <laughs> just like, okay, well, I'm going to bring those ninjas and those cyborgs yeah. over there. But then it would be nice to see how the other characters, like Shao Kahn or Montaro or yeah. whoever, how, what the take on them is going to be. Overall, like you said, I wish there, I wish there was a season three. Yeah, I just, at least know what happens. Uh, if you just look at it as a prequel, a non kind of prequel, because some of this stuff don't match up to. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you just say, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, it's kind of a prequel to how a tournament would have started. Yeah. Um, but but I'd say watch it. I'll say yeah, I recommend quite it. Interesting taste, yeah. and the fights are pretty good as well. Yeah, yeah. It loose with the like you said, loose with continuity. If you're alright with that stuff, yeah, watch it. Yeah, it's good. Uh, okay, so Scorpion's uh, Revenge. What Love this. Yeah. Yes, this animated uh, movie. Yeah, this is your first time watching it. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Awesome. I'd say I'd say it's well animated. It's very well animated, and it's. Gore- it's, it's funny because it's like it is gory and bloody. Yeah, but there's no need to see as in yeah. 18 rated. But it's only 18 rates because of how bloody it is. Yeah, right? and the murders. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. That's a bit of yeah. yeah, oh. oh you know, really? it, uh, Scorpion's just slicing people in, and they look like... Literally, steaks, like, you know, five like, minutes. Chunk, just... Like chunks of... Their body's slicing three parts like, and then the middle part's like a chunk of a steak. Yeah, like, see, what? Like, <laughs> what? Oh, wow. Uh, but sometimes it's like cartoon... I, I mean, it's all seriously bloody, but it's cartoonishly gory as well because Jack says his arms ripped off. Yeah. And uh, you're all, okay, he flops on the ground. And he's probably going to bleed to death. Oh, no. Raider has his little speech, and then he kind of feels Jax's stumps. And like, yeah, yeah, but look at the, the holes. Yeah, oh, no. those are, he would have, he's probably bled out. He's probably got yeah. him. Like, He'd been dead like two minutes ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, Raider, when you head of all there, heal him first, and then yeah, speech, yeah? then. Oh. But it all makes it. Uh, I think it all kind of it wraps up pretty well, even though it's moves really quickly yeah it's only 80 minutes uh, long but if you take away the credits it's probably 72 yeah, minutes yeah, it's like and, and uh, obviously it's all focused on Scorpion but you know it's funny it's even though it's called Scorpion the Revenge you know, it's focused on him but yeah. he's not the main character no, 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 <laughs> yeah. No, I, I, yeah yeah but yeah. the other characters they, I mean they get enough divided screen time yeah but he's got more backstory than the others yeah and uh, Luke Han's just there because, like literally he's there because he's the chosen one or whatever yeah uh, Sonya Blade is chased like they do the standard backstories but then give them much more than that yeah. they're there because of the reasons that they are there yeah. and that's it that's which, it that's, that's kickstart our uh, oh, which by the way so they do the intro for Scorpion yeah. and then later on through the uh, then they start wrapping up everyone else's intro yeah. so it's like alright but we know we're here for just, what, what we're here for so yeah. it's not really that important but you just need to know why they're on the sides of the same sides side of, yeah. and like like I was saying like you were saying well it's they're not seen as like C characters evil. They're like like Scorpion be A plus character obviously yeah. because it's main Scorpion Revenge. Right? Yeah. But they're like A minus because they they're not like throwaway yeah. one liner people. Yeah. Like they're important to the yeah. the, the, the entire tournament. Um, is this my, <laughs> I just love this. Um, there's lots of little things about it. As like, uh, by the way, by the way, yeah, uh, I'm just gonna reference Mortal Kombat Annihilation because I forgot to say this and it just popped in my head. Yeah. Did you like how Sonya Blade's kiss of death fatality happened? <laughs> when I first saw it, oh, that's cool way you're doing it. And then oh, yeah. shit, that's like, this is dumb. No, no, but I was like, I was like okay, they worked stuff in there, in the yeah. violation, they worked stuff in there randomly to, to like, oh, we worked this in here. Yeah. But the fact is, when the computer, uh, that the cyborgs all were like in the, the, the tank, and, yeah. up and uh, she's got the like, dust in her hand and she blows it, I'm like, all right. And then he sets up, it's that explosion. Yeah. Like, like, okay, it, it makes sense. It makes, it makes sense. sense. It's not super contrived, but it kind of like yeah, it's I was like logical. <laughs> if you're going all in with this in this game in this film, yeah, you just went all in with her. Yeah, do it anyway. Yeah, 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 just keep on going. Then. Yeah, if you keep on going as far as you can go, <laughs> then it'd have been entertaining. Yeah. But anyways, back to but this. Right, yeah. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah. So I enjoy, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty good. I liked how as well. Um, because it was always Quan Chi who's who yeah. the the. the Mastermind. Yeah, well, not necessarily about the, the, the guy who just he Look just keeps around. on stabbing everyone. Yeah, everyone. Like, yeah, no one trusts him. He's done so many like t- betrayals. He probably betrayed himself at some point. Yeah, yeah, he's, yeah. He's, he's but that's so <laughs> what is what is so good about it is that he's done so many of them that he, like, that Shang Tsung's like, I can't even trust you. Yeah, you're on my side. <laughs> I know. 
Typically, I knew you were going to try and poison me, you fool. <laughs> I am like, oh, you, you betrayed everyone at this point. No one, no one trusts you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But it, it, it's just so funny. It's just like, even, you know, you should have known that yourself at some point. Yeah, it's like, come on now. You're, you're, known, you're, you're from the hell as well. Well, never realm. Yeah. No one trusts you <laughs> from never realm. Come on now. It's like... Oh. I, no, I, but I thought the fights were uh, pretty well done. Yeah. And, uh, like... The characters then stuck to the rules of Mortal Kombat yeah. more consistently. Yeah. But then again, how do you get these demons out of nowhere that Johnny Cage is punching in the face and Sonya Blade is also fighting? It's just like, yeah. Right, okay. And uh, I can't remember who it was. I don't know if it might have been the Johnny Cage one, where he just randomly walking in. A bra- is it Baraka that fights him? Yeah. It's just like, but he's just walking about. He's just got, you know. But I did like how... So it was Johnny Cage, Sonya, and Liu Kang. Yeah. Scorpion helped them deal with a bunch of ninjas. Yeah, the black, yeah, no, um, the um, black dragon mercenaries. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and uh, then when I think right, did Raiden come down and say once more combat's been initiated, then everyone had, you have to uh, then the tournament rules are in action. And then Johnny Cage was like, "Oh wait, have you declared war combat? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> have you <laughs> declared war? No, if no one's declared war combat, then we're cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. I was like, see, he's seen the broken much. <laughs> yeah, yeah." <laughs> Ryan was, again, Ryan was going to be like, what? <laughs> you can do this? <laughs> 10 fun years of North Korea. <laughs> wow, wow. How many tournaments? And no one's done this. What's going on? Why? No wonder I'll not be here this. <laughs> not smart. <laughs> so like, yeah, I thought that was hilarious. I was like, oh. Well, I did um, the fight with Brackus and Johnny Cage. I thought it was funny. Yeah. He was like, dude, what are you doing? Why is yeah. this? Why is the stuntman attacking me? And then he realizes, like, oh, he's trying to kill me. I don't think it comes off as a... Uh, uh, a dope, yeah. but like a lovable kind of like yeah. roguish dope. Where he's like, okay, kind of. But Johnny Cage, when you realise these people are trying to kill you at some point, yeah, because you haven't got a script that you're asking. Yeah, exactly. Like, like, unless he watched all reality TV. All I'm going to say is, uh, he, but he's super high on drugs and he doesn't yeah. even realise what's going on. But they don't show that. And yeah, the movie well, he's that the tap because you know rich people, some rich people, yeah. the tap from life. He's yeah, yeah. The, the tap from life. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't understand someone trying to kill him. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, um, I did like how as well the team of Johnny Cage, uh, Sonya Blade, and Liu Kang were yeah. like in the original movie and kind of I want to show you how the games were. They they were the mortals in the game. Yeah. And so and you saw they, they kind of bunched together. Yeah. And they I know they didn't say yeah, no, it's funny enough in the game Liu Kang won the the first uh, first tournament and yeah. then he beat Shao Kahn in the second tournament. Uh, or the follow-up. Well, yeah. I don't want to call it a second tournament, but let's call it more combat. Yeah, yeah. It is, but it's just like, okay, so how do you have one the definitive winner in a tournament where everyone fights everyone and yeah, when yeah. you say Earth run one uh, because Liu Kang, Liu Kang then defeated the final guy yeah. rather than Liu Kang was the winner of the tournament by defeating because yeah. that would have that mean like he would have maybe had to defeat other people. It's just, no, you, your side won. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah, yeah. They've never actually explained that no, in the no, game. No. Like, if, like if, it, if it was a team-based tournament, yeah. they'd say, yeah, Earth Run won because of Liu Kang, which makes yeah. him the champion level. But yeah. it, it doesn't... <laughs> no, that's it, but, that's, yeah. but through all these incarnations of it, mm-hmm. they still follow the inconsistency yeah. of it. So you can't say that they don't know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. Because yeah. just... the rules, that, they, they follow the rules as the rules. Yeah, it, yeah. everyone's following the rules uh, that way. But I'm just saying, in a fighting game, you fight one on one, yeah, and uh, in the uh, then you go up the the pillar yeah, where yeah. it is when you find the next person, but you can fight yummy well from people as well. Yeah, so in the game, so yeah. who knows exactly what's going on? I need to ask Ed Boon. This makes sense. <laughs> Excuse me, but exactly what is the, uh, the 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 rules for the actual tournament of Mortal Kombat? I bet at this point he probably doesn't know himself. <laughs> he like, like shrug. Uh, if if you declare Mortal Kombat on a guy. Then you're fired. Yeah. If you All if right. you say no. But what if it's on my own, my own team? What do I? But then realistic, like if that's the case, if someone says no, shouldn't you win by default? Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> no, 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 no. Then uh, then Sonya Blade will have lost. Yeah. That's why it makes no sense. <laughs> it makes no sense. Um. Yeah. Back to the the film. Um. I liked. It just shows how insane um, Scorpion is. Yeah. As soon as he sees Sub Zero, he just attacks him. Yeah, and yeah, kills yeah. him like, but dude, do you realize that Sub Zero you're fighting? That's nothing like the one that killed your family. Clean up, I think it sounds like. Unless he's taking the entire clan, but that's a different matter. Yeah. And it's just like, this. Uh, when you. 
when you say something to the guy, yeah. why do you kill my family? Waiting for him to say something. Why do you call out him out or something, yeah, he, right? And then he say something and you might think, okay, even he's lying yeah, or, or something else is going on. But they were like, I'm, no, Scorpion's just going to kill him and not, and he's going to get a chance to, <laughs> yeah, he's going to have a chance to answer back because then he start poking holes in our yeah, plot. No, like, no. Because no. <laughs> like, even like, going back to Legacy, by the way, I know we're, we're having a laugh at it. Yeah. Because that, but it's actually really, it's, it's really good. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're just, we're just poking fun at sentence. Yeah. Um, like in Legacy, even when it's on Zero and Scorpion Fine, like, dude, I didn't kill your family. Yeah. You're lying. You're scum. Like, no, essentially, I haven't done it. <laughs> yeah. But he's not listening. So he's like, you're not, yeah. yeah. But <laughs> he just, how he kills him as well, is like, so ODD. Yeah. He jumps off a cliff with him into a spike and then yeah. kills both of them. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> But why did you? Why did you need to do that? <laughs> because I get why. It's like then I end, I end his. I kill him. I end my suffering because I don't live. No, my family is dead anymore. Yeah. I revenge them. But then, <laughs> Shao, not Shao Kahn, uh, Kwan, 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 Kwan Chi being the idiot he is, knowing that Scorpion is pretty much immortal at this point. Yeah. Decides to tell him it was really me. That killed <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you never uh, know. And then. <laughs> Okay, well, I guess uh, I mean, Scorpion's like in, in pill, but it's rubbing it and going, you know what, maybe it's a good time to, to try and come back at yeah. something. You know, I, mean, I am fully dead. Oh, fully dead. <laughs> you know? We've established that, you know, <laughs> hell couldn't kill me. So what's a spike? Oh, I better me? just start climbing out of yeah. this spike, isn't it? <laughs> Into the final fight. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> and then that final fight, I like the notion in this game, I like the game film, Yeah. that they built... They built up Luke Kang, you think, okay, he's gonna beat Goro. Yeah, yeah. And he doesn't. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh snap. Yeah, and he's about to get his arms torn up. Yeah, and then, then Sc- Scorpion gets the hero and jumps around <laughs> And kills Goro with OTT way yeah. ever. Pulls off pulls out his skull yeah. and leaves his face attached to his body. I, I did always <laughs> I did always think there was gonna be something like uh Luke Kang fighting Shang Tsung at some point. Yeah. But they they forego that. Yeah. They, I mean it wasn't necessary in the story they were telling, which is fine. Yeah. Um, yeah, the champion did like the the the, the hope of all humanity, Liu Kang. He didn't. He had to have help to defeat Goro. Right? Yeah, and I like how after that bit, when Lu, when when Liu Kang's like, says like, I didn't beat the champion. He goes, that was never your destiny. Your destiny is to beat Shao Kahn. You're like, oh, that makes sense because yeah. he does beat Shao Kahn in the game. So I know in one of the true endings of Mortal Kombat One. Yeah. It's actually Scorpion that wins the tournament. Oh, really? Yeah, and then he defects the Earth Realm. That's why Earth Realm wins that one, and oh, then okay. that's why all that weird stuff in 2 happens. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, well, well, I mean, hey, uh, are you looking forward to the new Mortal Kombat film that's coming out? Uh, that will be coming out sometime. 2021? Yeah. Yeah. I am actually looking forward to it. I would like, though, for there to be a sequel to this. This, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, they probably will do an anime. I, so, I mean, I, 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 let's do it in a separate continuity. It's just, yeah. It's just tricky when we want a sequel to more Kamen Legacy, but they've got a movie coming out, so they're not going to be yeah, another like, yeah. Anime can get around that because yeah. Yeah, yeah, DC yeah. and Marvel do all the time. Yeah. So, um, um, I'm looking forward to it. I have yeah. no idea any of the cast. I'm oh, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. So, um, when I got the guy, the guy, so the dude. I call him Buff Jimmy Olsen because he's Jim- the Jimmy Olsen from Supergirl. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And I say Buff Jimmy Olsen because he's six foot four and he's muscular. Mm. And he's like, this, this guy's not like a Jimmy Olsen type whatsoever. Yeah. Anyways, he's playing Jax. Uh, okay. Which makes sense. I'm not that. Yeah. Uh, but I don't know how much his physicality is yeah. um, for a film that's all about action. Yeah. That's as far as I know the casting. Um, I don't know. I don't recall anyone else offhand. Yeah, because I, mean, I didn't look into it because I remember... For the last like twenty, I want to say the last ten years, yeah. there have been like rumors of there's more combat filming in New Orleans and nothing yeah. have come from it and then all that stuff. So I sort of gave up. But I'm glad that they finally are. While one brother still has the rights to it. Yeah. Well, yeah. Let, let's just see how they pull it off because uh, will they even establish? Will the rules always be consistent across no, these films? Yeah, yeah. Like, which I are think that's the rules? I think they have to. I have to stick to that because I think if you if they change it, yeah. The hardcore fans are like, why are you doing this? Yeah, yeah, like, it's the rowdiness of, let's have fights, yeah? yeah. But for no reason, right? And not only that, yeah? But you can then fight this guy right after he's already yeah. fought this guy, and you can be a proper heel by taking advantage of a guy who's tired. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. But that's, like, that's how it is. Yeah. Um, but I, I, I'm looking, I want to say I haven't seen anything no. enough to say I'm looking forward to it, not looking forward to it. 
But if these are themes, I'm definitely yeah, they will. Be, you know, I mean, it's maybe intrigued. Oh, I don't, I don't know, say about remix version because it's already, it's already got enough beats. Yeah, so I reckon gonna, if you can't, you can't make it move any faster. No, or you can't. If you make it slow, it's not the same. Yeah, yeah. No. But I reckon they're probably gonna sort of follow more of the story of the the newish games. Yeah, yeah, rather than. Well, if they're smart. They will, they'll do it in Walking Back 9, like, pretend the old films happen, yeah. but then retcon this Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. uh, they changed, the, they went back in time and changed yeah. certain things. And... Which made the timeline, in a way, worse. But yeah. yeah. But then I think they streamlined it, so that, uh, they wanted to streamline it. Yeah. So, they, yeah, but like you say, they did, should have just done a crisis on Infinite Earth yeah. or something like that, or like a zero hour, or Infinite Crisis then. And readjusting like, the timeline and saying, oh no, this is the new streamline, uh, the streamlined timeline that we're going to do. This kind of, this stuff, maybe, maybe didn't yes, happen. This, but happen. this is, this, this is what did happen. That's literally what it is. Because <laughs> even, I know, and then I've done a new one as well. You, when you think about it, it's true. Yeah. Raiden is actually the bad guy because yeah. in 9 to like 11, he does so much stuff that makes everything worse. Yeah. And then I was like, dude, you're the bad oh, guy. That don't remind me. Um, the how they did Raiden in Mortal Kombat Legacy. Yeah. yeah. So I thought that was quite cool. Yeah, and you know what that reminded me of? Thor. Yes. Yeah. Ultimate Thor. Yeah. Um, where it's like, oh, is he a mental patient with the power plant? And I was like, I don't know if they just coincidentally came out of the similar things at the same time, uh, near enough, like, or was it inspired by by one or the other? I think it might be because I know. It might mm. be the Ultimates first. Yeah, because that came out like early 2000s and yeah. that came out 2011, didn't it? So yeah, yeah I think yeah. he took little bits of it from that. But it made sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah it made yeah, sense. Yeah, I like uh, that. It made sense to keep him out, away from what the the tournament and the people. Yeah. Because then he can't, it's, it's too late for him to explain what's going on to everyone. Yeah. And that's why Earth, Earth Run will be in the, on the back foot yeah. in this continuity in the more combat MCU. I'm like, oh, okay. Him, fair enough, fair enough. Didn't they, they drop that in season two, though? Well, yeah, he just never appeared. He never appeared, yeah. But he appears for like a second with Johnny Cage. No, that's in... No. I thought he appears in number two. Yeah, I think you're right. Well, I mean, it get, didn't get to the point where he said anything to yeah. establish anything. Yeah. But yeah, um, I'm looking forward to it. I would recommend, if you get a chance, watch more Combat Legends, Scorpion's Revenge. Oh, and the, just the final cap off. Yep. So I was telling my friend that we were going to speak about Mortal Combat, and yeah. he said, he said, tell everyone straight, yeah. the best Mortal Combat is Mortal Kombat Conquest. <laughs> Oh, got that TV show. <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah. He said, he said, I won't accept anything else that anyone says, Walk Up and Cold Coast is the best Walk Up. I'm I actually, well, I'm not going to lie, when it came out, I was watching it when it came out, I actually did enjoy it. And I was quite annoyed that how it ended. I was like, oh. I have to say, I watched the first couple of episodes and I was like, the guy playing Shang Tsung, I don't know his acting, but he's just kind of, I don't know, kind of hammy and stiff at the same time yeah. you know, as to as to what his role He wasn't playing with Pinaz, yeah, uh, in my book, but where you know, um, but yeah, yeah, I, I didn't see too much of it to say. It's, to, to, I think there's two seasons, yeah, and I know one episode I really liked because it had Sub Zero in it, yeah, and I was like, oh, this is pretty cool because Sub Zero is my favorite character in the whole game. Like, oh, that's pretty cool, and then how they left it like he's still on the run from the Lin Kuei, but I think they confused it with they made young Sub Zero the old Sub Zero because. The second Sub Zero, he's the one who goes on a run for yeah. the Quake, he's going to be controlled by that. Yeah, the yeah. second one is actually an arsehole. That's the, in the in the continuity, he's an arsehole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they kind of merge the characters together. I, I tell you what's kind of funny in Conquest, they didn't use any of them other than Shang Tsung. Yeah, and Kwai Jin, Kwai Chi comes in in the end. Yeah, but they didn't yeah. use any of the significant cast no. that you would expect them to. But I guess they maybe they couldn't, and they're yeah. like, all right, fine, we'll just use all these other side They'll characters. They'll use people that are descendant. Ancestors of these people, yeah. yeah. Bit weird. Yeah. Um, wouldn't watch it again, though. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, overall, quickly rank which one? Top to bottom? Top to bottom. Okay. In your opinion. Uh, so, okay, I probably... Here's the thing. Legacy didn't have... So, uh, I probably put Scorpion the Brand's uh, top because... Yeah, yeah it, it was definitive for the yeah, practice time, yeah. sorry. Um... Quality wise, then I'd put Legacy, even though it, it never finished and you know what the, the, the story was. Yeah. It's just that it looked, I retold certain things better. Yeah. And then I put Mortal Kombat 1. Yeah. Um, so the action's decent and the, the theme song was really catchy. It's just that it was a bit, I don't want to say, oh, it's, 
It was entertaining. Yeah. There's yeah. Not, not much going on with other characters there. Yeah. Whereas Legacy covered certain yeah. things. So you, you, you know, uh, even backstory to people that, I mean, to be fair, didn't, didn't finish the tournament. But, but, but yeah, it's still you gave enough really. backstory to, you know, what's going on and you cared about. So yeah. The, the, you were intrigued to see what was happening. Yeah. And of course, the Nightly Show is just yeah. it, it's too far down <laughs> too, beyond the, 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 it's the, the beyond everything else. Like, I'd say everything else is kind of what you can watch and you enjoy. Yeah. But this is just, it's, uh, you know, it, like, so you, you, it's only four films here we're talking about. I'd have that at number 10. Yes. Yeah, so, you know, like, I have films that don't exist. Yeah, that. <laughs> then yeah. put it at the end of that. I'll have to so- agree. I'll agree with you. Like, I'll put, I'll put Scorpion's Revenge at the top. Like you said, Definitive covers everything. You know it's more about Scorpion, yeah. Anymore, but but you knew like Scorpion's Revenge, no yeah. what it's about. And it's sort of and how it's how it ended because they could just leave it at that, but yeah. then it also ended where you can yeah m- make that universe bigger if you wanted to. Yeah. Then it would be Legacy yeah. because I like Legacy, like you said, the new takes on certain characters and it made you interested to see where it was going to go. Yeah. And then more combat. Will be thrown because it's more combat yeah. and it's just the best of the nineties. <laughs> and then annihilation would be minus ten, like you, yeah. because they had so much going for it. And then, like you know, some just films are cheap. That's the problem. You no, know, like some films, you get halfway through, like yeah. hey, this film's terrible. Yeah, two minutes into that film, you're like this film is terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then you can't even hate watch it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, terrible stuff. Yes, don't watch it. Or well, <laughs> yeah, definitely. Don't watch it unless you want to punish yourself. Yeah. Right? We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Yourself. Yeah. Well, um, so yeah, Mortal Kombat. Two thumbs up. The franchise in general. Yeah. Um, we'll end this episode. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, thank you all for us for listening to us. Um, somewhat bitch about some of the films, but it was all in comedic. Attempt, you know, we actually yeah. did like three and a four. Uh, uh, yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. No, 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 it wasn't. You know, yeah. <laughs> everything we despise, everything we were saying for real. Yeah, like, that, <laughs> my nation, I like said, Venom. that of Venom and the hatred. But you know, it's a little joke, but they're still great films. Um, there's any other like franchises or anything, game series that are films, even the Resident Evil, <laughs> yeah, 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 which oh, I love. Oh, um, let oh, us know in the comment section or drop me a message or whatever. Yeah. We'll be able to do some research and hopefully do it. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. now we're going to sign off and I'm Kyle Charles along with CY Chow and thanks for taking a trip around Whiteverse. Bye. 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 B